All Saturday was a big day for state teams. VCU and Liberty were in search of conference championships, while UVA and ODU were looking to make their conference title games. We start with the Rams. They face Dayton in the A-10 title game at the Diamond. VCU needed one win to punch a ticket to the NCAA tournament. Bottom of the second, Dayton's Mariano Riccardi bloops one to left center. That scores Eddie Persinger from third. The Flyers would jump out to a 3-0 lead after two. UV VCU will start their rally in the third behind the conference's player of the year, Taylor Locklear, who singles the center. Hogan Brown scores from second to make it 3-1. Top of the fourth, VCU would load the bases and Hunter Vey would come in to score off the wild pitch that will cut Dayton's lead down to 3 2. Couple of batters later, Stephen Carpenter drops one to short center that scores Connor Husak. Husak and UV, VCU rather would take a 4 3 lead. Couple of batters later, Jay Curtis can't keep the pitch in front of him. Locklear breaks for the plate, makes a great play to avoid the tag. The score, Rams score five in the inning, the lead 6 3. Bottom nine, 7 6 VCU. Tying run at the plate for Dayton, and it's Locklear who makes the throw to first to give VCU their first A 10 conference title since 2015. 7 6 the final. The Rams are headed back to the NCAA tournament, and they did it in front of the home fans. You know, players win games, and you know, but you know, administration helps win championships. And to have that thing here, and to give us this opportunity, our friends of Flying Squirrels made this possible. And uh, for all of our fans, everything they've been through this year, these parents, they, they waited a year to see their kids play, and they get to see themselves be champions on this field. It's just this is a dream come true.